Now that I've crossed. See, now I'm back into Hummingbird. Dude, I don't understand. Don't like me much. Yes, I am a gunman. Everyone saw him. He shot me first, though. He shot me first. I mean, yeah, I did trample him with my horse, but those are it's alternative facts. All right, that's fake news. It's fake news, chat. Okay, I think I need to turn my survivalist map back on. See, now I'm in this I'm in this bush area. I am looking I'm looking for butterfly weed, which I thought was in tall trees, but I cannot find it. Like I've looked all over every section of tall trees for butterfly weed and it do, it's not it's like only hummingbird sage as I'm able to find. It's it's seriously almost like the game is glitching. Because I know it's not going to be in the Great Plains. Because I know that I went this way when I was looking for, uh... Whatever. Remember, it would disappear off my map because I crossed the borders. But, like, I was in this area looking for butterfly weed. Before. And now all I can find is, like, hummingbird sage is that? That's hummingbird sage? That's more hummingbird sage. Come on, would you a screen? Could you, could you not? Maybe I'm not looking for butterfly weed then. There was definitely two plants here. Hold on, I'm, I'm gonna Google it. As soon as my browser decides to load. Maybe I'm an idiot. Plants in tall trees. Stranger, stranger, show some brotherly love and slow yourself for a man and me. Get out of here, dude. You're going to steal my horse. There we go. Survivalist challenges is what I'm looking at. Ooh, there's a Red Dead wiki. Okay. Maybe I am an idiot. I, I'm, I think I'm an idiot. Hummingbird Sage, Violent Snowdrop are the only two things in tall trees. Prairie Poppies, Golden Courant, Beecher's Hope. Yeah, I'm just dumb. Chat, I don't want I don't want you to look at me right now, okay? I'm just dumb. I'm just dumb. I don't want you to look at me. I, for some reason my brain was telling me I had things there. I had things there. Cuz I did the golden currant, I did the prairie poppy, I did the hummingbird sage, I did the snowdrop. So yeah, everything else is back in the back. Okay. All right, I'm just a dumb I'm just a dumb. <sighs> I'm just a dumb. Okay, um, we're going to fast travel here. JK, we're going to we're going to ride. I'm gonna go, uh... Eh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me think. Should we go do part of the story? Because I kind of want to kill bears, but I don't want to do it right now, but I feel like I should go kill the bears before we leave this area. 
So I think I may go do Ag the first Agent Ross mission. I think I'm gonna go do that first. Let's go do the first Agent Ross mission. I wish there was Liar's Dice in, uh... Come on. In Blackwater. I'm a little upset. I love me some Liar's Dice. Prairie Poppy is by far the most uh, most abundant thing in the game. Yeah, dude, I avoided that train like crazy. Riding faster than a train. People just fade in. All right, save the game. There we go. Everyone's talking to me, even though I'm inside my house. Video games. Video games. All right, what time is it now? 2 a.m.? Okay. Save it one more time. Save it one more time, and then we're going to go do the first story mission here. General Ross, or whatever his name is. Glenn Gary, Glenn Ross. Bob Ross. Watch your step, partner. Sorry, Mr. Here, Martin. Hold here. Fine morning, Fort okay? Mister. Here we go. Okay. Police. Bear one another's burdens. Bear. B E A R, though. One oh one, one oh two, one oh three, one oh five, one oh. One oh. I'm here to see Mr. Ross. One oh seven, one oh. Fifteen, ninety-two, one hundred thirty-seven, nineteen, one hundred nine, fourteen. Upstairs on the right. One. That guy gotta be so rude, huh? 15, 116, 117. Dude's got to be so rude. Mr. Marston, so glad to see you. How was your journey? Where's my wife and son? Being well looked after. Well looked after. I want to see him. Mr. Ross wants to speak with you. We've had some... Important developments. You want me to take out a gun and blow a fucking hole in your head right here? <clears throat> right now? You want that? Mr. Marston. You want that? Mr. Marston, I ask you to calm down. Why? Why? I did what you asked. I got you Williamson and Escuela. It's over. Stop playing games with me. <laughs> no one's playing games with you, Mr. Marston. But if we were to play some games, there'd be some interesting ones we could play. Would you like Sir, to play a game? Like hanging you for murder, or confiscating all of your property, like that little farm of yours, or, or having you put in an electric chair. Those are the sort of games we could play. But we choose to play a different game. So calm down and play along with us. Where's my wife? 
You know, I forget. But I hear it's very nice this time of year. <sighs> Mr. Marston, please. I've never insulted your meager intelligence. Do not insult mine. We've done this little deal for your freedom in exchange for all your men from your old gang. You gave us Williamson and Escuela. We still don't have Vanderlyn, but now we know where he is. Then go and shoot him. No, sir. I want you to shoot him for me. And then I'll let you be. Uh-huh. The last thing I want to do is make martyrs out of all these people. He could be killed by some petty squab or by another lowlife. We believe Vanderlyn just holed up with a group of renegades near the wreck of the Serendipity Riverboat. Ah, <sighs> yes. Another group of renegades. Obviously, the first group, your group, has, shall we say, been disbanded? <laughs> disbanded. Anyway, Mr. Ford and Mr. Marston, shall we go? Oh, Mr. Marston, your wife and son are, are doing well. Let's both try to ensure things stay that way. Okay. Mm -hmm. Up to you, sir. Let's get going. Let's get going. Oh, Mr. Marston, one more thing. This is for you. You're too kind. See, I have nothing nice but gun. your best interest at heart. Let's hope it doesn't go off by mistake. 343. Oh my god, this dude. I, I have a patent for that, sir. This is an outrage. Oh no! Oh, Mr. Marston, <laughs> you're alive. Hello, Wes Dickens. <laughs> Thought you were headed to Peking. Um, so did I. So did I. In a long story. But now it seems I'm being put under arrest and charged with narcotic possession or some <laughs> other such nonsense. Ross, have him release this man. Why? Because he's a harmless old fraud, the kind of man that built this country. And because he helped me get Williamson. He did do that. Did you hear that, officer? The man's a hero. Let him go. Come on, Marston. Moral degeneracy waits for no man. Let's hurry along. <laughs> this dude. 344. He better be in Red Dead, too. 347. He skipped six, chat. He skipped 346, chat. Bad count. He's got to start all over now. Hey, look, a car. Fancy. Head for the wreck of the serendipity, Mr. Fordham. High-powered pistol. I like how the motor car literally goes slower than the horse. Lawbreakers working together for the good of civilization. Like you always say, sir, the higher the stakes, the smarter you have to play the game. I can't imagine I ever said anything quite so trite in any case. I'm yeah, remember sure you guys tell me like on day one that, that that was the best gun. I need to try it out. Rip 346, yeah, for sure, dude. The unique opportunity we're operating. In. Son of a whore. You best watch your damn mouth. Or is it? Strange you should say that, Mr. Marston, because according to my files, or you is are it? the horse son. Now, what else can I recall from the files? Oh, let's see. You killed hundreds of innocent people. You have robbed at least 40 banks that we're aware 40? of. 40? They told us there was a prize when you got to 50. I'm Lol. glad this is all such a joke to you. I want my family. And I'm sure all the men you murdered wanted their families, too. That's a good point. Now, you're stupid, but you're not that stupid. We both know how this has to be. And it could be all over today. As soon as we find Dutch Vanderlyn, you can go back home and play being a farmer again or whatever else you've been pretending to do for the last few years. First it was Bill, now it's Dutch. After Dutch, it'll be somebody else. Where does it end? It ends when we say it ends. You're in no position to make demands. Like you will. You don't just walk away from that. Buy a few chickens and make it all disappear. You should be dead or rotting in a jail cell by now. We are giving you a chance at new life. A chance at redemption. You can't erase your past, Mr. Marston. But we can. It's been exhausted. It's exhausted, Chad. So tired. Okay, I'm skipping. We stopped talking. This guy's the slowest driver in the history of the planet. It's 
not far now. The old serendipity wreck has been used as an occasional criminal hideout for years. We were informed that Vanderlyn and his gang are making camp there. We'll stop on the cliff above, and you and Agent Fordham will go on foot. I'll stay with the vehicle and keep watch. And you'll do as I say, Marston. Don't try anything stupid. Oh, I think he knows what's at stake. Don't you, Mr. Marston? Let's find Dutch and finish this. Wreck of the Serendipity. Right. Let's go, Mr. Marston. Mmm, ham. Ham by the Ford Motor Company. Keep quiet and stay close. Yes, sir. Stop moving. Vanderlyn is the priority. We go in. Would you? Would out, you walk? Get the hell out of here. Would you walk, Quick sir? Clean. You leave Dutch to me. We don't want you getting that suit dirty. If you step out of line, <laughs> you, 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 it's because you were so well, bored. You went anyway. I hope you're aware. Of the I hope you're feeling better now, man. That sucks. Is he on the boat? Seems real quiet, don't you think? Yeah, I would say so. You Good job, me. calm down. Maybe Dutch caught wind of things. That informant better not have been lying to us. Keep your eyes open. They are open. I don't see nothing. It doesn't feel right. This place is usually teeming with lowlifes. Up there. You go investigate. I'll keep watch here. Cat. Investigate the noise, chat. Anyone in here? Go on. Those screams are coming from somewhere. No, you don't say. Cha the stairs are literally on the other side, chat. Okay, calm down, dude. Quit screaming. Stairs are up front. Dude, I literally go the wrong way every time, don't I? It's like my it's like my trademark. Whatever way I need to go, I always go the opposite way. It does sound like Sean. Sean! Sean! John. Over here! I found him! Good God, that's her informant! Gnostics, what the hell's going on here? It's a trap! Shit! It's a trap! You'll have to carry this man! I don't think he can walk! What the hell's happening? It's a trap! We need to clear a path out of here! This gun's pretty good. Nice. Yeah, this gun's pretty good. But I have to use it right now, too, so it's pretty good. Where's my emote app? Plus, I want one for tier one stuff. Uh, dude, Twitch, they were submitted for approval a while ago. Uh, there's Twitch is taking their sweet time getting them done. I would say any 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 second they should be available. It's just however long it takes Twitch to do it. That ain't all of them. Put down your weapon. That isn't even close to all of them. What do you mean, all of them on the boat? Ah! 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 
Dude, no 9mm today is this accurate, just for the record. Got him. Yeah, that hasn't been updated yet because there are no emotes. You can still vote, but uh, it's not going to matter. I've already submitted them. Tier 1 got Z-Swig's okay. Tier 2 got Z-Swig potato. And Tier 3 got Z-Swig mind blown. Oh, my God. I didn't realize how... Uh, how quick I can shoot this thing. Let's keep moving. There we go. The path looks clear. Let's get back to Agent Ross. It's hard to run right now. Carrying a, carrying a large Native American. Who's this? What in God's name is going on? I just want to just for you. Well, you can sub tier two. Marston, lift this fellow into the back. Sorry, man. The world, the 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 tribe has spoken. The, car so we can get out of here. the potato lost by like three votes. It was pretty close. There might be more of them. Well, they obviously caught our informant, and then they trapped us. And who is this savage? A prisoner? Is that, this is the informant, Is that a sir? potato? Do you speak English? Uh, uh yes, he does, Oh, it's sir. just He's literally the, the potato he emoji. With me for yeah, him. you could definitely do that. We found him tied up on the boat. Then they jumped us. Nice of you to help us out. Hell of a plan sending in two men to take on an entire gang of outlaws, especially when one of them's an office clerk. Or... Social secretary or yeah, some such. Just shut your mouth. Turdlaw, thanks for the new follow, my man. I appreciate that very much. Welcome to the Z Swiss community. I hope you uh, have a great time here, man. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for the follow. Okay, I was going to skip, but now it's not letting me, so something must be about to happen. Maybe not. No, okay. I knew something was gonna happen. Come on. Did the car now. just break down, lol, dude? What's wrong? Frickin' Henry oh, Ford! Piece of out. garbage! Well, fix it, you fool. We need to I knew we should have bought a Dodge! It's Dutch's men. Marston, we'll hold them off. Hold them, we'll fix that damn engine. Yeah, crank it! Crank it! Like Soldier Boy! That's why the heavy repeater is still good. Felt good. Is there more of them? God damn it, boy. Them. Are you gonna help me? Who's left, dude? Everyone's dead. Do something, Marston. Everyone's dead, dude. There we go. Caught them all. We got them all. Keep cranking, dude. That's gonna fix it. Just crank it. I can't see any more of them. Fordham, are we ready? Yes, sir. I think so. Good job. He cranked it and fixed it. 
Wouldn't that be great? That's how you Let's fix cars in real life. Like, oh, my entire transmission's blown. Just crank it ten times. It's like Hail Marys, but it's cranking for cars. Damn, that was close. We're lucky to be alive. I'm beginning to see why Mr. Marston here has made it to such a ripe old age. Nice bunny. You make me blush with all these kind words. So much for this automobile of yours. If this is the future, God help us all. It's not the automobile. Bad workmen shouldn't blame his tools. Perhaps if Mr. Fordham maneuvered it with a little more finesse. I would agree. I he does drive slow. Ambush, sir. Even if it was running fine, that still have caught us. I agree. Walk faster than this piece of crap. A agreed. Give me a horse any day. Super slow. So what now? Do I get to see my family? No, you didn't kill Vinderland, you moron. I don't know. In that case, old boy, no, you don't get to see your family. It's a fairly simple agreement, Mr. Yeah, Monster. I mean, even I understood even it. for a man as devoid of intellect as yourself. If you'd like me to explain it to you again, I'd be more than willing. No, you said enough. We'll find Vanderlyn soon enough. For now, however, I suggest we call it a day. So how does it feel, taking a man's wife and child from him? Does it make you feel good? I don't how think he cares, dude. hundreds of men in cold blood? So, I mean, he's You're got me there. Coward. You're a murderer. Actions have consequences, Mr. Marston. Come now. Try to look on the bright side. The bright side? There ain't no bright side. Your family is enjoying a much-needed vacation, and in far more luxurious surroundings than those to which they are accustomed, I assure you. Hey, did all of you non-subs know that if you sub for $5, you'll no longer have ads and you'll get an office awesome emote? Wow, what a great value. We should take the Indian to Professor McDougal. See what he can I get out my of controller. It. Good idea, sir. Like I just can't communicate with them. And I dropped it like as far away as possible. Here we are. Thank God for that. So, this is the office of an anthropologist named McDougal. He was thrown out of Yale for a degeneracy. Oh, I'm sure he's lovely. Tell you something. Indeed, but he's been helping us. I appreciate that, Ren. They see I appreciate they that. No rush, though. I appreciate you just being academics. here, my man. Appreciate you just being here, my man. Give me a hand here, Marston. Ah, Mr. Ross. Uh, Mr. Fordham? G good day. G good day. What on earth's going on here? Kid got shot in the leg. Beat up pretty good. We'll send a doctor. Now, McDougal. <laughs> Official. <laughs> we need information uh, from this fellow about Dutch Vanderland. Can you see what you can find out for us? Do my best, sir. Oh, goodness. Make sure you do. <laughs> Professor McDougal has been a good McDougal. friend of the U.S. government, Mr. Marston, just like you. Why don't you see if you can help him in his study of the native problem in this county? That's a good thing. Oh, that sounds great. Sounds like I'm going to kill Indians for no reason. Contribute to the trail of tears and the horribleness of American history. Can't wait. Can't wait. Gonna sub to the podcast too. Yeah, make sure you sub here first, though, because I have to split that money with Colby. No kappa. But if Colby asks, I'll deny till I die. <clears throat> um. Okay. So we can start with the creepy dude. I'm uh, the fact that I'm one away. From this deadly assassin outfit, like, really helps. So give him a wink. Eliminate all other players of a game of poker and armadillo. Never getting that. Claim a treasure honey, a treasure hunter bounty. Complete California Strangers task? Like, how have I not ran into that yet? Complete a night watch job in Chuparosa. Search Sidewander Gulch. Claim a Bandito Bounty. That one I'm pretty close to also. I don't know if I'm going to get all of these, to be honest with you. I don't know if I'm going to try to get all of these. Like, I do want this one. Rank 10 in all ambient challenge. I can get Legend of the West. Like, I feel like that's the one that I want. I feel like that's the one that I want the most. You want you want a wink official player? Here you go, my man. Here you go. Different eyeball for you too.
There, there's a wink for everybody in chat. Is poker hard or something? Uh, no, I'm just incredibly bad at it. Deadliest, oh, really? Maybe I should try it. I mean, I would assume Ar Armadillo is probably the best place for me to win at poker. I would assume it's the easiest there. That'd be my guess, at least. Is there a stagecoach here? Yeah, right up here. Tallulah and Wapiti. Good street names. Yeah, there's a wink for everybody Where in chat. You are, mister. Get on in. Right ass passenger, okay. Okay, gotta tell you, never really driven one of these before. He's yeah. never, what do you mean he's never really driven one of these before? Demon plays games. Hey man, welcome. Thank you for the follow. You guys are so kind today. I appreciate it very, very much. How much money does it cost to travel? to Armadillo. 19 dollars? Let's do it. Thank you thank you so much for the follows today guys. I appreciate it. I got some ginger ale so hopefully it'll settle my stomach before after before and after dinner. Yeah, dude. I love ginger ale. I know a lot of people out there really don't like ginger ale, but I'm a huge fan of it. I think it's delicious. All right guys, I'm going to run to the bathroom, um get some more coffee. So give me a couple minutes. I'm just going to leave it on this screen so you guys can LOL as it's attacked by wolves or whatever and I'm not here to defend it. So uh I'm not going to skip just yet, but I am going to jump. Uh, what am I doing? I'm going to go to the bathroom, going to grab some coffee. Give me a couple minutes, and I'll be right back, dudes. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for the follows. I appreciate it. BRB. All right, guys, I'm back. It looks like I'm going one mile an hour. Like, look at how slow I'm going. Have I even made it out of Blackwater? I mean, look, I seriously made, I seriously went 10 feet. I went from here to here. I'm gonna take a nap. Dude, this is the slowest driver of all time. Like, no joke. So slow. Cemetery.
I bet. Slow as you went. There's no one playing poker right now. I don't know how the general store is still open. What can I do? My mistake, sir. I ran into that dude, lol. Are of the finest quality, sir. That's what I want. The Southwestern Railroad Company is just a front for the Jews. It's a racist. Legit, every Western movie or game has a town that looks just like Armadillo. Oh, totally. Absolutely. Hey, mister. There's a lamppost in the way, chat. Get away from her. Even if you're good at poker, I bet it would still take forever to bankrupt everyone. I don't think it's too bad on Armadillo because there's not too much money. I wonder if, like, I could just bluff everybody out of their money pretty quickly. Man's pride can make him do crazy things. Also, it depends on how many people are playing. Like, right now, if one person's at the table, how y'all doing? You know, like, you that could right be way there? easier. Excuse me, friends. I'm very eager to play poker. Oh my god, there's a bunch of them. Let's try it. Let's see how it goes. Let's see how it goes, chat. Herbert Moon! I'm Herbert Moon! Okay, 10 and 8. It's terrible, but I'll call. Okay, I got a pair of 10s. That's pretty good. Like, see, let's see if I can bet, like, 12. Because I got a pair of 10s. See, they fold. Okay, well, I'm bleeding them, I guess. Give me something decent this time. I'm going to take a day off next week. Good for you. Seven, a seven, and a jack. Call. Okay. I got a seven and a jack. So far, not too great. Well, we'll wait for the flop. That's a call for me. Let's see what the turn is here. Yeah, see, I'm doing terrible. I'm doing terrible. Um, I'm gonna fold on this one. That's enough for me. Yeah, I would have. I would have got nothing. I got money to keep my mouth shut. Them bean eaters got a right old civil war brewing. All right, you quit being racist, dude. I know this next hand is gonna be my hand. Now I'm either lucky or foolish. Okay, everyone just folded off the deal. Okay. I'm looking a little hog tied. Okay, nine and an ace. Pretty good so far. Let's do it. I'm calling. Oh well, there's no There we go. We got a pair of nines. A pair of nines. It's no fun if you don't have them back wing tomatoes. Gave my boss the ruins. Them bean eaters got a right. Would you stop with the bean eaters, you racist? Fold. See, these guys fold so easy. These guys fold so easy. Like I'm gonna have to bleed them, dude. See, Swig's blind. Why am I blind? Because there's a because of the blind you, in the in poker. It's a four, not an ace. Dude, you know what? Words are hard. All right, king and a four. Come at me, chat. Call. Uh, I fold. King and a four. Around, Mr. I'll check. Bean got a right old Would you stop with the bean eaters? I'm here. To play. Four and a king. I'll check. No thanks. God, this is terrible. Looks like you might have me on this one. I mean, I might as well stay in. You two pairs. What a jerk. He wins. He wins 39. Let's go. Skip to my turn. Okay, I got an ace and a four. We'll call. 
We're still going around? Would you stop with the bean eaters? Ace and a four. God, I'm so bad, dude. Let's let's try to bait him. Let's bait him. Like they'll all fold, I bet. Count me in. Yeah. Like maybe I just need to do that. Maybe I just need to bleed them. Problem is, I have no idea how much money they have left. Like this could take all day. This might work. A three and a two. I'll call that. Raise is forty. I'm gonna raise again. I'll raise again. Let's go. Oh man. Did that dude just go all in? Let's. Time to get down to brass tacks. What is it? What is going on? Let's make this interesting. Okay, I got a pair of threes. I oh, I got three. Oh my god. Kings and threes. I beat him. Three of a kind with threes. They say Mr. Marshall. Them bean eaters I win. Would you stop sure with the bean eaters, dude? So I think two of them just busted out. out. Most pe like I most of them are done. Bro. Most of them are, are dead. Hmm. Sure could have used that last hand. Okay, I got an ace. No, that's a four and a two. I'm gonna call. Now I'm either lucky. I'll check. No turning back now. Those are terrible cards, dude. I check. Plays liars out. I'm doing this for a challenge. I know. Would you stop with the bean eaters? It's so racist. You must think I believe anything. What's in the pot? Fifty-eight. I'm gonna fold. I don't have nothing. He probably bluffed me, dude. But I don't want to give him too much money. Ace and a king, that's what I'm talking about. Call. That's what I'm talking Head about. Spin. Okay, I got an ace, king, jack, queen. Okay, if I get a 10, if I get a 10, dude. I see these guys fold like the second I bet. Losers. What's that mean? Dude, don't talk like that. Was it better than the Bean Eaters? He folded me They both just folded immediately. Yeah, I got rid of Herbert Moon. He's already gone. Herbert Moon's already gone. Ain't you mighty angry. A jack and an ace. Let's see how much money I can get out of this guy. Are we going to be men about this? He bets all in. Okay. Southwestern I'll call. Company is just a front for the Jews throughout the country, you know? Them bean eaters got a right old civil war brewing. Sure is shooting. Okay, and Jack and an ace. I'll check. This guy's going to bet, though. Check. I really need something to happen for me. Okay, I got a pair of jacks. Ace high. Pair of jacks, eight highs. So that's something. Check, please. I mean, unless he could have two hearts. That, that's probably, I mean, that's... I'll bet. I mean, a pair of jacks is pretty good. I'll call it. Yep, I win. You know, nice, I'm glad I kept going with that. I'm glad I kept going with that, because that dude... Would you stop it? A heart? What? Thought I had that one in the back. He only got 21, though. We're, we're good. We're good, though. Because he only got what he went all in on. I got a queen and a four. Chat, you tell me that doesn't look like an ace from back here. All right, you tell me. A queen and a four. I mean, it's blind. I'll call. Call you. Oh, my God. Look at this. I got, I got a pair of queens already. I'll call. I'll raise. 
Let's raise it. I think I'll raise. Dude, it went all in again. Ugh. I see you want to play. Let me, go, let me go just like a ridiculous amount. You born chicken? Or you just lost your ball? Okay, so I'm still fighting the dude who went all in. He got a pair of aces. He wins. <sighs> he had to have a pair of aces, dude. You're joking. But that's all the money he has. Unless you want to start working for Pepper right. Guts, you'll this keep John as far as possible from the governor's mansion. Well, Don't someone's four flush now, man. We got a queen, a king, and a nine. Okay. I'm gonna check. Okay, I got a pair of fives. King high. It's terrible. I'm gonna call. He call. raised. He raised. I keep raising. Every, I mean, everyone's got a pair of fives. So if someone has a pair in their hands, that's gonna be that's gonna be rough. All right, we're off. All right. I'm gonna raise. I'm gonna try to scare him Why off, chat. This might this them. might backfire on me, but I'm gonna. Oh no! Now I'm someone can have a full house now. Shit. Oh, they see they both had full houses, chat. I shouldn't have pushed. I'm busted. He lost, though. Got rid of one of them, I guess. That's something. Okay, I got one dude. Let's 1v1, bro. It's 1v1. I need to get a good hand and then go all in. A 5 and a 3 is not going to be it. think I'm going to call. Okay, I have a 3, 4, 5, 6. I almost got a straight. If we get a 7 on the turn or the, or the river... I got I got nothing now. It's just literally nothing. I'm gonna fold. No, I'm out. You're laying on your arm and it's tingly. Tell me more. It's gonna be tough. I agree, dude. Easy there. One v ones at least I can I can hopefully bluff him out. God, I got terrible cards though, dude. Just get terrible cards. Forget it. I'm just gonna fold. When I don't get good a good hand, I'm just gonna fold from now on. Four out of five. Yeah, if you go for the stranger, though, please turn off my stream. Uh, four out of five. I'm just gonna fold again. Yes, I'm folding. Okay, now I can check because I do the big blind. So funny dealing now. Time to get down to brass tacks. Okay, three and an ace. That's better. Are we going to be men about this? Okay, let's see what he got. Okay, I got a pair of aces. That's good. He folded. Good. I took some of his money there. Took some of it. Okay, I got a pair of threes, chat. Bet. I got three of a kind for threes, chat. This That's is a it. Check for me. Count me in. God, he folded. What a jerk. What a jerk, dude. Two and a seven. That's poop. I'll check because I might as well. <sighs> Two, three, four. I'll just keep checking. No thanks. Okay, I call a six. I call. Let's see if I can bluff him out. Sure. I'll bet. Good. Worked. Okay. Awesome. Because I had nothing. I'll take his money. I'm slowly bleeding him. Let's do this. Okay, I'll call. Time to smoke out the phone. He raised already? Okay, four, five, six, seven is what I've got. Four, five, six, seven. So if I get a three or I get an eight, it's going to be good for me. I'll check. 
I also get. Do I have a pair of aces now? No, I have a jack. Let me let me double what his bet was. See if I can smoke him out. Of here. Okay, he called it. God, this sucks, dude. I have I have nothing. I have nothing. I'm coming off the rim rock. Okay, good. If I go crazy, he'll he'll fold. That's good to know. <laughs> oh man, I lost him a lot of money too. That feels good, man. His chips are getting a little low over there. I'm slowly taking him out. Okay, I got a four and an ace, so I'll call on this one. I'm gonna call. Oh man, they're giving me back cards though. I'll check. Check. He's gonna bet six. I'll call. God, they're just. See, this is why I'm bad at poker, man. I just get bad hands constantly. You're in. Good. Why don't we raise the stakes a little? He calls it. Pair of twos. God, I got nothing, dude. Okay, I'll play some bet. Yeah, if I go all in for him, he'll 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 stop. So every time he bids, I'm just gonna kind of risk it and go all in for him, and then he should pass, and I'll slowly bleed him out of the game at the very least. A five and an ace. I'll call that. Okay, I have three Fair aces. Enough. I have three aces, chat. I'm gonna check. Time to get down to brass tacks. I have a full house, chat. He'll probably fold. Cause yeah, this is the game I could beat him, so he'll fold. What a turd. Stack's getting a little low over there, chat. I had a full house that he folded. Two and a nine, garbage. We're just gonna check back and forth. Hmm. God, how terrible. Sure well, I do have a nine, a ten, jack, king, queen. So I'll do a small bet. Sure, I'll bet. Okay, he's raising. He either, if he has an ace, he wins though. Chat. I call. Pair of jacks, I win. Okay. Sounds good. I still win. Should have bet more. Let's get this show on the road. Okay, a king and a nine. That's good. I'll take a king and a nine. He did he seriously? I I ain't gonna play that game with him right now. I'm just going to slowly bleed him. Like, every time he bets like that, I'm just going to go all in. He'll fold. I'm going to drop my lasso around, Lady Luck. Reel her in. He went all... He's seven at all in. Okay, I got a nine and a ten. I'll, I'll call, call one. I'm looking for a man. <laughs> I'm looking a little hog-tied. God, I got nothing, though, dude. He had a pair of aces. He's going to win that money. That's going to keep him in the game. The pot's only 14. Like, he's, he's so close to having no money. Damn. He only has 14 uh, chips. I have 983. Five and a ten. Let's try it. Wow. You're real sure of something. He went all in, chat. No. He, he, can, he can have those 20 chips. That's fine. He can have those. Yeah, ace, ace, king, and a six. I'll just check. I check. Let's see if I can go all in. See if he'll fold. I'm gonna raise that. Yep, he called it. It's a pair of sixes. Well, that's what I had. I'm gonna win. All right, he should be done. He should be busted. Well done, all right, we did it, chat. We did it. Okay, update my outfit.
Nice. All right, so now what else do I have to do for that gang outfit? I have to complete a horse-breaking job at Ridgewood Farm, search Solomon's Folly, and purchase at the tailor in Thieves' Landing. Okay, well, that was six ones easy. And you were saying that the assassin was awesome? Which one were you saying? Law? Deadly assassin outfit. Okay, which, what do I need left for that one? Win a duel. Yeah, see, I want that one. I'm almost done, dude. Someone's got to duel me. I wish I knew how to duel. Like, I wish there was a way to trigger it is what I mean. Like, I know how to duel, but, like, someone has to challenge me. Hey, you want a duel, bro? Want a duel? He didn't want a duel, chat. Oh, him. You want a duel? Herbert Moon, you racist. I think I remember, like, the very first time I came to Arla De Armadillo, someone wanted to duel me, and I just ran away because I didn't know what it was. That's probably the only time I'm ever going to be challenged to a duel here. Because I need it, so why would it happen? Listen, dog, why don't you calm down? Just riding through town. Ain't no one want to duel me. If you want to force a duel, put on the elegant suit that John receives in the first few missions and then get caught cheating in a por poker game. How do you even ch how do you cheat in a poker game? How do you cheat in a poker game? Not sure? Yeah, I don't even know how you would do that. Maybe they accuse you of cheating or something? Come on. Maybe it's a new option that shows up if you have the elegant suit on? Okay, there's my two wild fever few. Got that done. Okay, and then the I need to go over to like this side of the map to get the other one. So let me just like um well actually, you know what? Let's kill two birds with one stone. For this outfit for for uh not options, journal. No, I want outfits. Wearing this high-class attire allows you into the high-stakes poker games in Blackwater. I should try that sometime. Um, yeah, I just need to do that. Purchase from the tailor at Thieves Lake. I just need to visit the tailor. There's a couple things I need, I need to scrap from. Uh, search Solomon's Folly. I'm almost done with that one. So where's Solomon's Folly at? Down here. Okay. So when I cross over into this area, I should uh, be able to pick up the third flower. So let's just follow this to the border, look for the second flower here, and then I'll head down to Solomon's Folly, which is in Rio Bravo, which will have the third flower for New Austin. And then I'll only have the Mexican flowers left, and then I'll be done. And then I will be done with, uh, with Survivalist completely. And I should get all the rewards that that brings. Also, I need to find armadillos while I'm out here. So if anyone sees an armadillo, be sure to put it in chat. And then I'll see it 10 seconds later and it'll be too late. 
but it's the thought that counts. And I think those are down towards the Mexican border anyway, so I don't think I'm going to see them quite yet. Right here, I'm just gonna check. This is still wild. Desert Sage, I think, is the red sage. I do need two. Okay, I can get two red sage while I'm right here. Because that probably means this right next to me is red sage as well. Nope. Wild fever few. That's random that they're in. I mean, I guess I guess that's true with the prairie. I just thought that they were in completely different areas in this game. Or up here in this area, New Austin. I've been marooned out here. You for a ride to the next town? Sure. Don't worry. I'll help you out. Take you to Armadillo. Here we go, madam. Come on. Maybe she'll duel me. Maybe she'll want a duel, chat. Come on. Why are there bandits after me? A long way to go. Chat, why are there bandits? What's I mean, what'd you do, lady? Why are there bandits after you, huh? What kind of lady are you? I've never heard this music before and I really like it. There you go, madam. My gratitude. Excuse me, I'm a married man. Why did I ever say that? Come on. I now I gotta ride all the way back. That's how much of a gentleman I am, chat. Remember that. I'm a gentleman. Fever few, not looking at it. Well, I mean, I'm looking at it, but I'm not getting to pick it up. Whoa. Red Sage here. Might as well. All right, so I got those two. Now I just need two Desert Sage. And I believe I'm done with all the flower species in New New Austin. I don't remember what Desert Sage looked like, to be totally honest with you. I think it looks like, I think it looks like Red Sage, but it's a little blue. Wild fever fuel over there. Yeah, here's some. A little purple. Purple flower. Perfect. Desert sage. Nice. Okay, I need one more of those. Go. And here it is. That's what I wanted. Nice. Okay, so the only things I should have left are like the four the four ones that are down in uh, in Mexico. Um, yeah, prickly pears are in Mexico because that's a cactus like one. Butterfly weed are in Mexico and woolly blue curls. Yep. Okay. Well, that's all I got left. So let's head down to Solomon's Folly 
and search that. We got to open the chest there to get the outfit update. So we might as well head down that direction. Let's go. This is like the first time I've really seen this part of the map in HD because I didn't really explore a lot over here the day I got HD. Because we like crossed into Mexico shortly after. Like we spent most of our time in the southern part of the map, so like just seeing this all again is kind of it's kind of nuts. Why did my checkpoint go away? Is it like over here? Oh, there we go. There's. I knew there was going to be like an action I had to do. I just had to figure out where it was at. Hey guys, it's me, Z Swigs. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you found it interesting, informative, and most of all, entertaining. Please leave a comment, let me know what you thought, and hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel. Also, come hang out with me every day over at twitch.tv slash zswigs. We're playing fun games over there. I love all of you, and thanks again for all your support.